M1 Global presents Ladies and gentlemen, this is an M1 challenge bout in the middleweight division. Now introducing your fighter in the blue corner. This fighter is 34 years old. He weighed in at 83.3 kilograms. He stands 175 centimeters tall and has an impressive record of 25 wins with 14 losses. He is a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt and a UFC veteran from United States of America, Luigi. The Italian tag, Finavanti! And now welcome his opponent in the red corner. This fighter is 25 years old. He weighed in at 83.9 kilograms. He stands 180 centimeters tall and has an unbeaten record of seven wins with no losses. He is master of sports in MMA and medalist of national combat sambo championships representing Legion team and Kuzaya team, Artin Frolov! <laughs> and your referee for this bout is Viktor Korniev. Fighters to the center. Okay, gentlemen, fight three rounds to five minutes. Okay, don't hit head, back head and spine line. Don't hit elbow to head, only to body and legs. On the ground, don't hit knee and leg to the head, only to the body and the legs. Don't touch ropes, don't touch trunks, don't touch gloves. Listen, my comrade, don't tire. You're a professional. Show clean fight. Shoot your hands. Go, corner. Luigi Fio Ravanti versus Artyom Frolov. If Frolov wins this bout, he will get a shot at middleweight champion Ramazan Amayev. Well, although the experienced guy, Fioravanti, he's fighting a tough, tough competitor in Frolov. Seven wins, no losses. Yeah, and Fioravanti, a tough customer as well, a nine-fight UFC veteran. Nice left hook there by Fioravanti. He challenged for the middleweight title himself in his last fight, but got dominated by champion Emeyev the end of last year. Had a couple of injuries since then. Had a one-year layoff. And now he's back against the young gun, Artyom Frolov. Yeah, Frolov's got powerful hands. You can see him just stalking Fioravanti, waiting for that setup. But Fioravanti's throwing them left hooks. He's caught him twice and third time there. The left hook catching each time. You can see the right of the face of Frolov already red by his left hooks of Fioravanti. Fioravanti said he's been practicing his jiu-jitsu, so if he gets tagged a few times, he may take this to the ground. He is a black belt after all. Yeah, Frolov on the other hand is a decorated Sambo practitioner, as many of these Russian fighters are. Has four wins as an MMA pro via submission. Oh, nice job. But also has heavy hands. Inside low kick by Frolov. As he stalks down Fioravanti. Oh, that tagged him. And that that stopped next. him in his tracks. He didn't like that, Fioravanti. He needs to clear his head. Yeah, Fioravanti clearly looks rocked here. Yeah, needs he to move out of that corner. Oh, yeah. oh he got tagged he down. down. This could be over. This oh, could be over. Look at the finish here. Referee looking closely. Hard shot by the Russian. Can he finish? Referee's going to step in, I think. Yes, he does. And it's over. Arthur Frolov finishes. Luigi Fioravanti in the first round. And will go on to challenge middleweight champion Ramazan Imeyev. What a display of dominance here against a seasoned veteran from the U.S. Wow. Great show of sportsmanship here by both fighters. 
This fight was meant to be the last big test for Frolov before he gets his title opportunity and he passed it with flying colors. Impressive performance by the 24-year-old Russian prospect. He's been a pro only since 2014 but already has shown that he belongs at the top of the middleweight division here at M1. With the official decision, here is Ian Freeman. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, after two minutes, 11 seconds of the first round, we have a winner by the way of technical knockout, Artem Frolov! Artem Frolov, club Legion Rostov, Nadal, Kuzny, Krasnodar, Russia! Артем, мы тебя от души поздравляем. Изрядно ты попортил броню итальянского танга. Давайте поаплодируем Луиджи Феравантии, настоящий, настоящий воин, ветеран турниров. Ну что скажешь, как ты готовился? Расскажи про твою потрясающую команду. Смотри, в твоем углу сегодня стоит один из патриархов ММА движения в России. Армен Данилян и весь Ростов сегодня с тобой. Краснодар. А, в первую очередь хочу поблагодарить Зал, спасибо за поддержку. А, мне было очень приятно. Да, конечно, хочу поблагодарить свой угол. Армен Рубенча, Даниляна, а, Олег, Вова, Серый. А, все знают, а, кто за меня болел. Много людей не перечислить. Всем большое спасибо. А, папа, мама, привет. Я вас люблю. Спасибо. Артем Фролов, Россия!